The accountant's profession is one of the fastest moving professions and public not only expects accountants to be holding professional values with integrity but also to look forward and take take up challenges in the ever-growing risk environment of the corporate world. We have to act proactively, otherwise we will not be able to meet the rising challenges. The corporate reporting is continuously evolving and new dimension has been added to the corporate reporting with the emergence of sustainability reporting. Environmental consequences resulting from the company's operations have a profound effect on the society and its people. Reporting these impacts will indeed drive the conduct of our business to more responsible initiatives. Keeping in view the rising interest of stakeholders in environmental information, the Joint Committee of ICAP and ICMAP has set up another award for sustainability reporting. Although this award will be officially launched from the next year, it was decided to have, have a soft launch this year to increase awareness among the general public. Reporting beyond compliance should be encouraged at all levels. Therefore, we have included those companies for this year's soft launch who are making sustainability reports on their own. I believe this award will provide a great platform for recognizing companies preparing voluntarily sustain sustainability disclosures. The purpose for both these awards is to create a healthy competition among the companies and to encourage them to give maximum disclosures. Annual reports are the only means by which the companies disclose their operational as well as financial health to their shareholders, investors, banks, customers and suppliers and improving quality of annual reports would definitely benefit, benefit them all. Finally, I would like to congratulate all participants in this award ceremony and wish them unprecedented success in their endeavors to achieve transparency and integrity in financial and sustainability reporting. I also applaud the members of Evaluation Committee for organizing this memorable event. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mr. President, for making us feel proud of the strength and growth of the profession in the last few years. Now, I would like to request Mr. Hassan Aziz Bergami to please uh, come in here and share a few words with, with us. Uh, Mr. Hassan Aziz Bergami, the President of the Institute of Cost and Management Accountants of Pakistan, brings to the Council of ICMAP almost 20 years of professional experience, which includes nine years of experience at boards of various listed companies. He is also a fellow member of the Canadian Securities Institute. Mr. Hassan Bilgrami is the founding CEO and director of Bank Swami Pakistan Limited. He is the director on board of Bank Swami subsidiary, Bank Swami Mudarba Investment Limited. KSB Pumps Limited, Halib Foods Limited, Institute of Capital Markets, and Pakistan Institute of Corporate Governance. Previously, he has worked as the head of asset management of NIT, as country manager, consumer banking, and corporate business with Gulf Commercial Bank, now NIB. Please welcome with a big hand of applause, Mr. President. Uh, Mr. Raman, Mr. Rashid Rahman, Mir, President ICAP, ladies and gentlemen, Aslamu alaikum. I frankly I didn't expect such a long introduction by Kareem. You would have just said that Simran Rami is the president of ICMAP and his term expires this December. And it would have done the job. But on a lighter note, I had the privilege of attending this uh, function or award ceremony in almost all capacities except the chief. Yes. I have been a member of the jury, a participant, a recipient of the award, master of the ceremony, and also president of the host of the city. So I sincerely hope you will pray for this elevation of mine. Now coming back to the topic, ICAP and ICMA have been jointly organizing this award ceremony for some years. And as Rashid Rahman Mirza pointed out, over the years we have seen a massive improvement in the quality of the disclosures and even the, the quality of reports that are being presented. 
There were times as a user, I used to struggle to find out the meaning of the disclosures and even connect them with different notes which were, which were frankly at times not even interlinked. But it's a sheer pleasure that perhaps due to this award ceremony, this award initiative of the two institutes, as well as the quality of disclosures that have improved over the years, an expert user can get all sorts of information that he would like to have from a balance sheet of a listed company that is published in Pakistan. And a lot of credit goes to the two institutes of Pakistan. Not only that, we have played an important role in evolving our profession and pushing them under, on the face of competition that we are facing as institutes in Pakistan, but we have played a leading role in developing the profession within the region. As an active member of SAFA, KAPA, and a founding member of IFAC. ICMAP is one of the renowned bodies in the world and one of the largest accounting bodies in Pakistan. You will be glad to know, gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, that this year ICMA, this year ICMA undertook some restructuring that was needed. We revised our act after 45 years and that, inshallah, will help us in positioning ourselves on the face of competition that we face from foreign accounting bodies and we retain our position as the largest accounting body in terms of students. The second initiative that we took was to bring ourselves in line with the market practice of offering or reducing the entry requirement at the high school level that was not present. These are the two initiatives that I am just mentioning so that you would know that ICMA also in the, on the face of competition and the changing environment restructured and repositioned itself. Now coming back to the account, uh, the topic of the ceremony, the quality of annual reports that you are seeing and Mr. Rashid Rahman Meer mentioned about PPL and Siemens, I actually got a, uh, got a complimentary note from a friend in Canada and he mentioned PPL's report and I see Mr. Khalid Rahman sitting here and I think all of us should give, give him a big hand because... With the So I will not stand much between you and the rest of the ceremony. Just a small correction, Mr. Raman has actually been to Pakistan this year five times, not four times. So that shows his commitment. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.